Hello everyone and welcome back to One Arm Robber. Today I got myself a little challenge because the other day I got a comment from Unhandy Sauce asking if it was possible to zip tie all the civilians in the Black Diamond Heist Casino. So I went ahead and tried it for myself. A quick overview before we start, there's a total of 60 civilians alone in the main lobby of the casino, then there are 5 in the security room, 1 behind the door in the manager's office, 2 mobsters out back, and the secret vault which has 6 civilians. For a grand total of 74 civilians, and we'll be zip tying 72 of them because we need to take out the mobsters to gain access to the secret vault area. Yes, I tried zip tying them and pushing them, but you go right through them. So sorry, mobsters, you gotta take the L on this one. And the only tools that we're gonna need to complete this is a lockpick and a battering ram. And since we have our game plan, let's get right to this. To start this heist, you wanna grab your battering ram and head to the front of the casino as fast as you can. Whether it be sprinting or bunny hopping, just get there as fast as you can. Once we enter the front of the casino, our next step is to glitch the two guards that are patrolling the inside. Which guard number one is the guard on our right here as we first enter. And guard number two is the guard outside the staff only door. This is the first guard we're gonna mess with. So leave your battering ram outside the bar area here, hop over the counter and get spotted by the two cameras behind the bar. It should trigger the guard that's watching the staff only door to come to investigate. Next, we're gonna hop the bar and go over here to this door, open it, and we're gonna wait inside. And since this is a restricted area, we're gonna wait for the guard to spot us. Once he does, we're gonna run into him. He'll escort us off the premises. We'll run into him again until the circle disappears. And now he'll be frozen in place. And he'll be stuck looking at the statue. Next, we're gonna take our battering ram Head over to the staff only door and break it down. Next, hide underneath the camera, grab the utility key card, come back through here, where I go up on the stage, go around this area, run through this door, scan the card, and turn off the alarm. Then we're gonna backtrack, go back to the stage, and grab our battering ram. And now we gotta just wait until this guard gets back into place to glitch him out. Once the guard gets into this spot right here, we're gonna wait until he walks over. And once he gets close enough, either break down the door and get spotted by him, or if you bang the door and he gets a question mark over his head, just run into him and then he'll be glitched just staring at the door. And now we can move on to the next step, which is moving all these civilians into places that we can zip tie them. So the first step is we're gonna come back here to the spin wheel. And there's nine civilians in total. And what we're going to do is all of them can be pushed and we're going to push them into the corner over here. By example, I'll show you the first one and then I'll skip ahead until we have all the civilians back here. Just push them back to this area right here. Also, the casino worker can be pushed. And once we get them back into this area, we have our first nine civilians taken care of. We're going to go into the bar area over here. And we're also going to push these civilians into that corner. Now, the two behind the bar, you cannot push. You go right through them. So they'll just have to stay here for now. So this first civilian here, we're gonna push from the bar and push them all the way into the corner, like before. Now the second civilian is a little close to the bar. So what we're gonna do is just run into him and doing so should push him away. And now you can push him all the way back to the corner. And now we have 11 in this corner and we also have two behind the bar. So that's 13 civilians taken care of. The next civilian we're gonna take care of is this one playing the slots right outside the bar. It's gonna be a little bit tricky, but this is how you're gonna do it. So that you're gonna run into the civilian from the right side. And you're gonna keep running into him. And what you're gonna do is crouch down. He should ascend to the heavens and go onto the slot machines like so. Next, you wanna hop onto the slot machines. And you're gonna push him across the slot machines. If he falls down like this, just go right here and you push him out. Since we got him out in the open, what we're gonna do is take care of all these civilians on the main floor right here, which is we're gonna take care of the two by the stage right here and we're gonna push them backstage. Simply get them around the corner here so the guard does not see us when we tie them up later. Right here should be fine. Just to show you, there's four civilians back here. There's one in the right dressing room, two in the left dressing room, and this guy just flexing in front of this mirror. We're just gonna push him away from the mirror and bunch him up. Next, we're gonna go up to the second guy that's right next to the stage and push him also as well. And the next four civilians we're gonna take care of is the one that we got from the slot machines and the three playing the roulette table. We can't do anything about the car dealer because we go right through them. So we're simply gonna push these four behind the stage. After we take out this four, we're gonna go over to the next table right next to it. And we're gonna push these two civilians. The car dealer here, we cannot push. He goes right through them. Now we've taken care of both these tables. We're gonna move on to the next table, which is a car dealer, which 
we go right through so we can't do anything there but the table right next to him has four civilians and we're also going to push them behind the stage this car dealer once again we go right through him so he'll just be staying here for the moment after taking care of these two tables head over to the two that are playing the slots right next to the stage and push them backstage the next two we're going to take care of are the two right here by the main counter and we're also push them backstage as well and since these are the last two civilians we're going to push back here we can actually zip tie all these civilians right now don't forget the ones in the dressing rooms for a grand total of 20 civilians after we're done here we're going to head over to the bathrooms and our next step you guessed it we're going to push some civilians into the bathroom Starting with the first person that we see playing the slots here, we're gonna push over into the men's bathroom because when we open up the door, there's actually a civilian in the bathroom already. Outside the women's bathroom, there's also two playing the slot machine. We're also pushed them into the same bathroom. After getting these close ones, we're gonna head to the main desk over here and this civilian right outside this main desk, we're also gonna push into the bathroom as well. And now we're done pushing people into the bathroom for now. We're gonna close this door. Now the two at the main desk, we can't push. We go right through them, sadly. So they're gonna have to stay here for now. Next, we're gonna deal with this whole area. And the place we're gonna push them is up in this area right over here. So simply we're gonna go over to this area first. We're gonna push the two civilians, the one watching the aquarium, push them into the corner right over here. This one, same thing as the bar guy. We're gonna go right through him. We should push him out. And we're gonna push him into the corner as well. Now all of these card dealers here, we go right through them so we can't push them. Just to show you. So they're gonna have to stay here for now. Next, we're gonna go down here. And the first thing we're gonna do is deal with this card dealer because this card dealer can actually be pushed. And we're gonna push them into the corner over there. After taking care of that card dealer, we're gonna come down here and we're gonna push this card dealer. This card dealer can move as well. This card dealer cannot be pushed. As you can see, we go right through him, but we're gonna push his civilian that he's taken care of. We're gonna come down these stairs and we're gonna take care of these two. This card dealer, we can go right through so we can't push him. And we're gonna push these two civilians. After getting those two, head back here. There's a person playing the slots. We're gonna push him as well. Make sure you don't get on this chair by mistake. If he does, just hop up here and push him off the chair. Now we're almost done. There's actually three over here playing the slots. One right here that we can see right here, one on the other side, and one right here. So now we're gonna push them into the corner. And after pushing the last civilian, we're ready to start this heist. But before we do that, we're gonna head over to the bathrooms once again and zip tie those civilians. And there's five in here to take care of. And there we go, we got 25 right off the bat. Next, we're gonna head back through the way we came by going through the staff door, hide underneath the camera, open up this door, head back to our truck, get our kit and grab our lock pick. Now we're simply gonna go back to this door, hide underneath this camera, like so, go over to the security room, unlock it, shoot the security guard behind the door, zip tie all the civilians, there's five in here. Grab his phone and do the check-in. Next, we're gonna close this door. Go up these stairs. There's a guard up these stairs. Take him out. Grab his phone and do this check-in. Take our lockpick. Unlock this door. Unlock this door behind the manager's desk. Open it. There's one civilian back here. Zip tie him. Close the door. Take our lockpick, unlock this door to the left, go down these stairs, unlock this door, but before we go through, we're gonna go down these stairs, take out both these guards, do the check-ins, go up these stairs once again, open up this door, make sure you have an idea of where this guard is outside. He's on the left side, so what we're gonna do is wait for this guard to pass by. Once he does, take out the mobsters, drag their bodies inside. These are the only two civilians we're gonna take care of. Close the shutter. Grab one of the mobsters' hands and use the scanner down here. Zip tie all the civilians in this area, which is six. And now we're gonna move on to the main lobby. Simply we're gonna go back to the manager's office, shoot this window. We're gonna jump out this window on the left side and keep hugging the left. Fall down here and the first ones we're gonna take care of are the two behind the bar. Zip tie this one, zip tie this one. No one sees yet. Take immediate right, 
do this corner over here that we did earlier. After that, we're gonna go through the bar once again. We're gonna zip tie this card dealer. It should trigger these two to come over here to investigate. Zip tie them. Zip tie this one. Head past the main desk over here. Hug the left as much as you can. Go up here. Actually let everyone see you. Zip tie this civilian. This one. Him, him, him. Do the corner here. After doing so, we're going to do the car dealer over here. It should trigger this one to see us. We zip tie him. And all we have left are the two by the main desk, which we go do, do. And now we zip tie all the civilians that we can in the casino heist. And with this, we completed the challenge of zip tying all the civilians in the Black Diamond Heist Casino. If you enjoyed the video, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe to help the channel grow. If you want to see a funny video, click the video on the left. If you want to see more War on Robert videos, click the video on the right. And like always, I hope you have a fantastic day, and I'll see you in the next video.